So just kind of thinking back to, you know, what that means and like how having faith and trusting in him and um, not to worry. It really it reminds me of the days of like whenever they were all in the NICU and there was little that I could do. Um, the only thing that I felt I could do as a mom was just literally pray for them. Um, you know, they're born at the Quints are born at 28 weeks and two days and they were like two pounds. And so I had to trust. I had to trust beyond my own strength and imagination of like what trusting God was and um, so that it just I don't know I just felt it was very fitting for um, just the shirt and um, it really connects back to the time in our lives when we were experiencing this high level of faith and having to trust God to the most um, and it was beautiful so here they are Quince nine years old now so yeah, the quints are nine. Well, they'll be nine on Monday. <laughs> um, but this is the fifth t-shirt we've done for five years in a row. They draw on it and they, you know, draw whatever they want. And sometimes it's random and sometimes it correlates together. Um, I think last year they drew like a bunch of animals. And so we kind of just put them all together, um, which was just weird. It's like you don't even tell them what to do. And they just all were like drawing flowers. They give me their drawing. And I'm like, Wait, y'all all drew flowers. This is so cool. <laughs> um, which made the shirt really cute this year. Um, but you can also buy those shirts over at Grace and Beast page. I'll put the link here. And all these shirts are raising money for the NICU. And so, uh, I mean, the Quint's first home was literally the NICU. So they were born at around seven month gestation. So 28 uh, weeks and two days. They were born and they were two pounds to four Two four two four two six, and um, so they're all very fragile, very very small. Um, and their first home was an incubator in the NICU for three months. And so um, we are uh, have a extreme sensitivity and heart connection to the NICU, um, and want to give back as much as we can. And I'm still trying to grow this type of. Um, uh, foundation or like something that could help parents when they're going through the NICU because there's so many needs that you need as a family um, you know but also just to give back to the NICU for the doctors and nurses and um, all the love and support they put in there so it's very very fragile time but um, Gus is scratching at the he is scratching at the door because he wants to come out which means I have to go pick up the dead bird with no head <laughs> before then so Ava brought me a couple things of grocery bags, and oh, I gotta go figure out how to not throw up while I pick up this dead animal. So, guys, hope you're having a great Saturday. <laughs> I'll put the link here for the uh, t-shirts. Thanks, guys. All right closing the shop down and so we will say see you next week or you can continue to shop online don't forget that the NICU give back tees have been released as of today um, and we posted the video of all the girls telling you which flower they drew um, and if you look down at the bottom you can see all the letters that they wrote um, for whose is whose and actually Riley actually put Rye <laughs> not just the R um, but they're available from size 2T all the way to youth sizes and adult all the way up to adult 2XL. So be sure to shop those and help the Quints raise money for the NICU. Also Thursday this coming up week, we will be dropping new collection and we are having our ladies night. So our Lincoln Lou that we had to reschedule due to weather a couple weeks ago is now gonna be on Thursday the 11th from five to eight. So come get linked forever and come shop Grace and B for giveaways and new collection. See ya.